through all right. Because it looks like the resolution is off. No, okay. So, I've kind of previously thought about doing Sky Factory 4, but the idea kind of fell through. There's been a couple more updates, but I think I... No, the mic should be good. Let's adjust that slightly. Okay. So, Sky Factory 4. If you know the other Sky Factories in the series, they're pretty good mod packs. However, this one has a new mod that is interesting, to say the least. It's a prestige. So, after you play a world long enough, the quests will give you a prestige point. Sorry, I'm adjusting the volume a bit more. But then you can use in other worlds. And there's all sorts of world types that you can get. Project Tree is blocked by prestige points. But... Oh, and I have previously completed the first page of the quest line in this world so that I have access to hoppers in any future prestige world. But I think I might try to get a co-op series going on another one of these worlds. Because like, some of these look like just normal sky block pretty much, but the floor is lava. Or infinite oceans without anything spawning at the bomb. Though, it looks like there's something back there. Oh well. A single chunk where, yeah, there's stone and dirt and stuff. No resources besides the lava and water. Floating sky islands. Still no resources, but interesting places to build houses. And then the opposite of these other ones, where everything's resources. You start with a dirt block and the dirt tree, so you have at least, like, something. And then just lava, skylands. Hardcore mode, permanently dark, but also uses sync system to act as lives. Except with no sky life, so always 100% dark instead of just nighttime. So the other more basic ones, and then the one that we are doing today, Prestige, I mean Compact Sky, which is why it's in a box with a tiny tree. Let's see, I don't think the bonus chest can even actually spawn, but I haven't generated enough worlds to guarantee that. And I want to see kind of what would spawn in it. If it does spawn in a compact sky. Because I'm assuming it would be just the normal bonus stuff. But if it doesn't, that would be kind of interesting. <sighs> and I've done something that hopefully will allow me to better watch the chat using um, making it so that the popped out chat twitch chat menu see there's the single prestige point I've from previous worlds like a couple of these time would be nice if it wasn't locked behind prestige but because, like, honestly, ore excavation on some of them for cutting down trees is very useful. But then you can also go into the settings and just enable that and have it cost the one point later. And honestly, 
you're not really missing out on much besides maybe the smeltery. And then this, I'm just not sure. These are kind of useful. Obviously, I haven't actually been able to play with them yet. But, yeah. So, this is the starting hub world for the... Let's just bump these down slightly, since I'm noticing a slight bit of frame drops. But this is just the starting world for the compact sky. It's just a whole bunch of these tiny machine hubs. Not going to go explore all of them because you can see it on the minimap. Kind of. But then you right click to get in. You start with the axe and you have tiny trees. Then if you press L, you can see the cat the advancements. And that's where you get a single prestige point from. So technically, I've played through on a different world up to this point. And then a couple of these get um, completed over time. But like... Well, no. Because you can craft these without a smeltery. It's just difficult. Uh, all of this is possible. Yeah. I think it is possible for you to complete all of these quests. Well, except for... Ex except for this one, I think. But... I think it's possible for you to complete all of the other quests without getting a lot of prestige points, but I wouldn't think it would be real fun to do it that way. So, the start of this world is just getting dirt resources. Because you go from dirt, to petrified, to bone, clay, and gravel, cotton, sand, coal, tin, iron, lapis, slime, redstone, lead, gold, silver, diamond. And then there's some other saplings that we can get, like osmium... Nickel, emerald, but those come at a later point. And then there's also a pig resource farming system. So, like, you can get buckets of mud that I think will. I haven't really used it, but will convert pig into that type of resource pig that you can definitely um, kill to harvest. I would think that there was another way to harvest it, but I'm not guaranteed on that. So don't trust me on that fact. Okay. So. We don't want to touch the bacon or donut, really. And the overworld cake is just to get back out into... Come on, load. To this area. But as long as you have the personal shrinking device... It doesn't matter. Also, I like how it's soulbound. Uh, let's see. If I remember cor correctly, C is... Oh, I don't want to get messed this up. 
because the I's are 1, the V is a 5, which means that's a 7 at the end, the X's are 10, um, So, if I remember correctly, it should be one hundred and twenty seven. Let me get a calculator real quick to check that. Not a date converter. Okay. C X X V I I. Yes, one hundred and twenty seven. Okay, the other thing is if I remember correctly, there was some way that you could repair yes. So you can repair within tools, well, you can repair all the tools using just pieces of the material. Which is kind of similar to how the Tinkerer's Construct tools repair, but it's alright. Okay. So, from... Wait, we still haven't got that sapling yet? Oh wait, actually, is there wood... Uh, what's it called? No. Because I don't need shears, I need... Like... Oh yeah, and of course the builder's wand that comes back in various mod packs. That doesn't actually do anything. Is there crafting grid? Uh, let's put numpad five. Oh, I can't do it on. Oh, okay. Hey, there's a sapling. Okay. Ooh, I like the crafting table with this. Oh, do I take the default crafting table that looks better, or I, do I take the Tinkerer's Construct table? Let's take the Tinkerer's Construct, because then I can keep stuff in it. Okay. So now that I have a table, I can craft at least two chests. Which, let's just place those down so that I have them. And actually, let's make a metahawk. just so that I have all the tools I could potentially need. And since it's wooden, it will... work and be easily repaired. Paxil Rose. Okay. So, I can make a piece of dirt, and then I can make dirt amber. But what I need to do is make more drying racks. So that I can make some petrified acorns. And is that also how I get... No, that's not how I get petrified saplings. Okay. Because I surround... Okay. 
So let's make a... Not cul... Well, I'll need a cauldron later. But a... Tub. Crushing tub. Get 12 pieces of wood. Turn 3 into that. Do four at a time. Oh yeah. So you may also notice it says here that the fertile soil needs unlocked. So if I break one of the bonsai pots, I have to do this very specific way to replace the fertile soil inside of it. Because it'll try dropping it as soon as I pick it up. Wait. Oh yeah, that's an item rack. They look very similar though. But that's the more useless cousin. Let's just craft two more of these. And if I remember correctly, yeah. I can pick up and move bonsai pots if I place them incorrectly or whatever. It's not really the most efficient way of doing it, but it means I don't have to deal with the fertile soil getting out. So wait, I need petrified for that. So five, and then that'll be eight. Let's do a couple more. Oh yeah, craft a dirt block using these. Bam, dirt block. Eating dirt. Cook any acorns in a furnace to increase their nutritional value. So acorns, well, to get cobblestone, we need uh, Petrified acorn and petrified resin. Which, once we get enough acorns, will be very easy, because it's just converting this dirt sapling into a... Uh, petrified sapling, that's what it's called. Now, it'd also be nice if I could get one more sapling. But, no such luck. And then it's just a matter of collecting all of the pet... A bunch of the petrified stuff. Okay, two dirt saplings. So I should be able to make a clay sapling now. Bam. Which then, with a clay sapling... Let's see. I should have enough dirt stuff. Once I get enough resources for a furnace, I can... Oh wait, actually. First, at compact. Okay. Obtain the grass block to gain a larger compact machine. And then a melter. So I need grass. If I add that to here, because then I can always quickly find what I need to craft it, which is leaves and mud. So actually... So, leaves and mud. How to get mud? Because that gives water. Which... Come on, give me something useful. Mushrooms. Oh, that's interesting. Beetroot soup. 
That's a cool way to craft uh, the stews and stuff. Then you can also do set up. Oh wait, can you? You can. So you don't need a brewing stand anymore. That's kind of nice, actually. Okay, but you need a dirt block and water. Which means that this is useless for now. Because we don't have sand. Well... I could make a clay bucket. So, if I, see, that's enough of those, and, like, sure, I can dry some of this stuff on it, but it's not really all that useful, because, like, the dried bricks, cosmetic stuff, you can turn cook things and cotton wood. Uh, the, that, I think I need to get the vines for something later, but I don't need most of this stuff. Sitting out unused till them. Because that's just taking up room that I can use for furnaces and other stuff. accidentally tap the Windows Home key there. Okay. If I repair this real quick... And that's the nice thing about wooden tools is when you can repair them with wood and you're getting lots of wood and that's why they're low on their durability. It's very nice to just be able to simply repair them. Okay. So, that's four of the eight. I didn't realize that there was a uh, rain in this dimension. Oh wait, yeah, because this is just in the swamp land, it instead of the compact dimension. Wonder why. Oh well. Okay. Oh yeah, that's why I'd previously done too. I'd previously also put um inventory tweaks in so that certain mechanics like chest sorting was convenient. Because I hate chest sorting myself, plus, like, setting up a crafting grid. Why bother when you can just have the game do it at a click of a button? Okay, so I need three more. That's not what I meant to do. Okay. I would imagine six trees... Wait. Okay, that was weird. I'd imagine six trees should be enough to get the three more. However, I did not imagine correctly. I need maybe two more trees. Yeah. Oh, three more trees. There it is. So wait, why was it being so stingy with these? 33, 
unless it just rolls the 33, 35% chance three times, which is one way to do it. Okay, but with the cobblestone comes the furnace, with the furnace comes the charcoal creation, and more bonsai pot farming. Okay, so can I, m I have the clay and petrified. Okay, so I don't need any more of dirt saplings, I need more petrified saplings. Because bone, sand, and gravel all come from the petrified sapling. Okay, so petrified acorn and gravel acorn. Wait, okay, there's the other one. So, one gravel tree. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna kind of want more clay trees later, but right now, don't really need them. Because I don't have enough room really to make hopping bonsai plot. Well, to make bon more bonsai pots. But. other thing is, is there chests that I can place right next to each other? Because there's shulker boxes. Uh, trap chest requires iron ingots. Okay, no. Chest builder. But not small memory chest. That oh, mm. no, mm. and their alloy, and their pearl, and iron ingots. Chorus fruit, apple, and liquid purple slime. Slime ball. P purple slime ball. Okay. Okay. Um. The stabilized redstone. So, yeah, it gets complicated after a bit. But. It also gets a bit larger of a space after a bit, too. Okay. That should be enough charcoal for now. So, wait. I needed to smell... What? Again? Clay. Yes. Because I wanted... So wait, is there? Yes, there is. But I want more bonsai pots. And the clay bucket. So, bam. Let's place that in. And... Are bonsai pots just a bunch of bricks? Yes. The so wait, it's sets of five. So five additional bonsai pots for 25 clay. Okay. So. I need mud. The 
that mm, that is how I'm going to have to get bone meal. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Which means let's remove the clay sapling. Place back in the dirt sapling. The way can I? Burn the leaves? It gives water. But then I can also convert the water into mud. Yeah, okay. Okay, so I do need the full thousand MB for to bucket it out, but then I don't need the full for that, okay, and then take out the leaves and drop one in, get the 3x3 three three tiny compact machine, which then allows me to do this, let's switch this to the another place, and then I can set up the trees I want. Okay, this is where it gets complicated. There. So, clay, petrified, or no, gravel and petrified. Then back out. That's kind of weird how that's glitching, but it makes sense. Okay. Three exit bonsai pots. Let's actually also make some more dirt. And grab three more of those since since it grows faster on grass than dirt and has a better chance of rewards. Oh wait, no, it grows faster on dirt, but has a better chance of rewards on grass. Okay. So those are all growing now. Let's place a crafting table up there so that I can easily access it. But it definitely loads faster than I was expecting it to when we first loaded into this world. Well, from the hub. Okay, so I need a melter or porcelain melter to obtain a larger compact machine. Which means I need more dirt. Which means... I might as well just use the rest of these bonsai pots, and then I can put the oak wood back in to get smelted. Actually, coal sapling needs birch sapling, which needs sand sapling, which sand needs gravel acorns. Okay. Let's put those back in. Dirt again, re-enter. So I need, don't need clay, I do need gravel and dirt. And then there is the sugarcane seeds, but until I actually have enough room to actually grow crops, 
Well, sugarcane to be exact. I don't have enough room. <laughs> Amazing how that is a factor. Oh, yeah, I forgot about the dropping flint. Because it normally doesn't. It's like very tiny of a chance to do it because it's 4% chance. Which is only as often as a sapling, but. Still, it's not expected. Okay. So can I make enough dirt yet? Yes. So let's grow out that one more time. The rest of those will grow while I'm in here, I'm pretty sure. I think it technically does grow, but it's like weirdly glitchy. Yeah. Just cycle that through more. Okay. So, gravel acorns. I need eight. So, what use is sap? Oh, I can make torches. Uh, let's see. So I need a oh, build bow. I need a petrified sapling. Which technically I can get saplings to drop from the leaves, but since I have so little room, it's not very convenient often, but since I'm seeking a single petrified sapling, let's try it. Well, technically I'm seeking two to get both the sand and the bone meal. Okay. Got one. Yeah, could be better, could be worse. Let's get the full sap bucket and then just make a couple torches cuz i mean might as well right okay um so petrified sapling and sand sapling okay then the other thing I want to do, keep one of the, so actually I need one more, uh, bonsai pots worth of that, and then I need another petrified sapling. So let's remove this dirt sapling, place sand sapling in. I could technically just turn, actually that might make the most sense. So if I turn this into a petrified sapling and then turn this into a bone sapling, then that's out of the way. So. We are what? Come on, where's my timer? Apparently I can't tell anymore. So we're 46 minutes, give or take, into the stream, and we're this far through the first quest book log. That's pretty good. And once I get to this point, I'll have auto hoppers. Let's make the advancement break a leg. Craft a bone sapling. Easy. Okay, so wait. I need a bunch of porcelain. 
is I need a melter, which is, okay, it's a one-to-one, -one, but I need bone meal and clay. Keyboard has this this little wire clip thing, but since it's not actually used by me, uh, let's see. Oh yeah, I also need some sand for the glass, gravel, dirt. Yeah. Oh, did I? What was it? It was a clay. Actually, iron. What do I need to make the iron? Not iron wood, but iron sapling. I need a melter. Well, porcelain casting table. Because once I get the 5x5, five five, the weight. I think you can get both of these once you actually get to that point, which really opens up the uh, setups you can do. Because since these are compact machines, you can pipe out of them the materials, which There, there is not the really fun barrels. Not sure how big this barrel is. I imagine it's pretty all right, but still it would be liquid, wouldn't it? So storage, maybe. Mm. No. Okay. Oh, I... Okay. Drop that. Pick up that. And this is why I set up that chest. Put the leaves away. Put those in the grass blocks. And the wood can go away. The dirt stuff. The clay can stay. Bone meal can stay, the sand can stay, petrified can go, gravel can go for now, because I want to also do the uh, smelt, oh wait, but the smeltery is locked, so actually that doesn't matter. Put the clay, put the gravel, okay, so... Bone, bone, clay, clay, bone meal, sand, sand, bone. Okay. Now that that's a bit more organized, those bricks are finished. Let's put more wood in. Craft another one of these, grab another dirt. Okay. Yeah. I'm going to need lots of bone. Well, less bone than I'm, than I'm actually going to need get. But more bone than you would think you would need at first. Because if I remember right, bone is also used in creating... Iron, amber, or not. Apparently it's lapis? Hmm. Okay. Then this creates lead. That's copper, amber. That's nickel, amber. That's sand, amber. That's gold, amber. That's iron, amber. Okay, so I need the coal tree. Which means that I need to clean off a sand tree. 
Okay. Let's put bone leaves, sand leaves. Okay. So I kind of need just sand loop sapling. That's, that's the thing that's really stopping me from getting the iron tree now. And once I get the iron tree, I can make the hoppers honestly fairly easy. Because every iron amber creates one. Okay. There. That should cover it. Let's get a little more sand. Because that's a couple pieces worth of sand then. And by couple, I mean five, four. Four, because that's, oh wait, yeah, four. F five. Clay, honestly I'm pretty okay with, because I think I have some in storage. Bone, that creates bone block, which creates nine bone meal. Yeah. Sprinkler system could be useful later. I'm not sure whether or not it works on bonsai pots. Okay. So back out. Put away the leaves. Let's grab the clay. The rest of that stuff can stay. Okay, so that's a bunch of mud. What did I put in this to get mud? Dirt. Okay. Honestly, for that, I might as well come back here and do a little bit more dirt farming. I need a factor of five. Yeah, that's the amount. Two extra bone meal, but it works. Alright. So with the mud, what... I can make dirt stuff. Or turn that into leaves. I mean, turn leaves into grass. Which is worth. So, I need water. Which means more saplings. I mean, not saplings, leaves. Okay. Then, uh, supposedly, I wash off that. Uh, do I need? Birch saplings for anything else. No, is what I'm seeing. Tin sapling. So yeah, I should make another birch sapling before I use it. Because it'll just save effort later.
Okay, the my talk literally doesn't mine leaves faster. So it's a waste of durability. For a second there, I thought a message had came in over Discord. Of course, I just said that it was a waste of durability to mine it with a Matok. Then I mined it with a Matok. Okay. That's the two saplings I need. Biofuel, petrified fuel generator, drying vat, drying vat. I th think I would technically need. No, because any tree should work for those two things. Well, actually, any tree should work for most of these. Well, any vanilla tree. Okay. So wait. I want one in storage and to cook the other. Okay, so stack in 12 of charcoal. Okay whole sapling, which means back into here. So I have gravel, dirt, petrified clay, bone, and sand, and coal. So I have one of each t tree type so far. Bad you can't like sprint in place because spamming shift is kind of wearing my hands down, which is part of the reason why having a automatic hopper, bonsai hopper, will be useful because then I don't have to worry about spamming the oh, you can use charcoal for that, okay. So, sand, clay, and gravel. Because, yeah, if I can just come in here to access chests full of for instance, dirt saplings and other stuff that's just been being outputted. That would be so nice. But I think I'm gonna have to set it up in the 5x5 five five once I get it all. Oh. Uh, sand. Because there won't be enough room in other thing, other places. Or, no, yeah, I should do that. It's like, I should definitely put the iron sapling, once I get it, into the 5x5. Five five. And some of the other more basic ones, too. Oh wait, that's a coal sapling. Can I use the coal sapling for anything? Yes, redstone. Which, I just need red dye. Obviously, I could use flowers, but... Okay. So, back out leaves away. Put most of this away. Coal piece, yes. No, let's not do that. Okay, so. Four iron amber, which then when melted gives two ingots worth. Okay. So 
So then I also need lots of, lots of these and lots of sand. No, I need lots of clay. Because that's nine. So, if I'm thinking it through correctly, oh wait, but that gives four. So, I need six for the melter itself. The heater, I think I need eight. And then three for the duck. Okay, actually. Horse. No, okay, so I need another six for that. The duck, I need three. And then I need eight for one of the two things. But then another eight for the other one. I think that's it. So I'll have one extra that I can't do much about. I could make a porcelain barrel. Sure. So I can store liquids. Okay, so. Let's craft the things that I need to craft beforehand. In the hopper shape to get a barrel. And then the rest of these need to be cooked. Perhaps I should go get some more petrified pieces. Just make a couple furnaces while I'm there. Yeah. Okay. But most of this stuff can go back in there. Enter. So I need petrified and petrified, okay. That's true, I haven't streamed since we got a new dog that'll actually, like, not have to go away due to attacking the cats. So, his name's Bilbo. He looks a little like a... I think he's a terrier mix? But... And the user has ears that are, like, just long since he was having some trouble after the vet so he had to get a cone and his ears would stick out the cone and it was so funny and cute okay so one more furnace so let's go back out make the furnace 
then I need to tear up one of these once I get the heater porcelain cooked. Because then I can just uh, use that for the heater itself. Of course, that means I'm going to build the heater last. Okay. I mean, it works, kind of. Ooh, there's now a Arby's cheddar and beef that I can smell sitting in the other room waiting for me. But it's way too early to stop. Cause the, I should at least go for another 40 to 45 minutes. Minimum. Unless it like crashes, then I might give up. Hey, Bilbo? Hey. Bilbo. Bilbo. Hey. Yeah, hi. Hi. Oh, big stretch. Hi there. Nope. Here, could I access my mouse? Yes? Yes? Okay. Okay, so that sack of charcoal's almost done. It'll finish and then go on to the next one, so yeah. Just get these two things cooked. Wait. So, in the smelter. Wait. Does would that cook at high enough temperature? Or do I need lava to fuel it? So I know that it can cook the tin, but I'm not sure. Bacon at zero degrees and cookie at zero degrees. But, I'm not sure if, and then, yeah, you can use bits and pieces for future things. But, I'm not sure if, actually, Cruz, Wooden, what's it called? Oh, cauldron. So, there's diamond and gold. There's glass cauldron. I could do it out of glass. I could do it out of cobblestone. There's normal cauldron. But, these cauldrons will burn if I try to place uh, lava in it, or try to make lava in it. So I guess, yeah, let's go for glass. Gonna need a little more glass. That's not where I want that. Nice thing is, once I craft the things, is it should trigger the quest completion. Okay, so I need sand. Making it the 5x5 five five just appear in my inventory. Then I just need a normal generator. 
for the next bit. What? What, Bilbo? Which means that I need redstone, iron, for like most of them. Redstone, iron, redstone, iron, redstone, ender pearls, uh, red and stone, soul sand, and wither skeleton skulls. Soul generator. What? Oh, uses uh, mob drops. I mean, can I craft bone? Could make it out bone amber. But I need wither skeleton skulls for that. Or... Does it change? No. Yeah, I need wither skeleton skulls no matter what. Magma blocks that I... Can... Yeah, I can craft technically. That requires mineral berries though. Which mineral berries require lapis and water. It's complicated. Okay, I can get a couple more blocks worth of sand. Because I think I need three additional. Which means now I need five more of the sap resin. Sorry, Bilbo. Don't mean to disturb you. What? Are you grumpy at me now? Of course, that is true. I haven't done my Snapchat streaks for the day yet. Oh, sorry, Bilbo. Didn't mean to almost drop a phone on you. I'm gonna mute myself real quick to figure out why the phone... There literally was no message. Thank you, people, for calling with a robot that doesn't register the other robot's voice. Okay, back out. Craft more sand. Waste more charcoal on that. Craft, grab a whole bunch of porcelain bricks. Let's put some away some of this. Okay, grab the iron amber because that's the more important piece of this. Did not grab the furnace yet. But if I. Yeah, because now I can grab the furnace. Okay, it's better to just craft it from memory. Because then I can just do it like that. Okay, there's the 5x5, five five, which means that I should... I hope this is the correct way of picking these up. Okay. But then I can turn... Wait, unused. Oh yeah, because I have to go into it first. If I place that up there, go back out... And then transfer everything in. Uh, let's see. Do I want...
gonna keep the water there for a little bit. So I'm going to need it for a couple things. But the rest of this stuff. Uh, let's just. Wait, can I? No. Yeah, okay. Let's just break half the chest, enter. Place the furnace over there, place the workbench right there. Craft a couple more chests. Okay, and I'll want the heater and the output. Let's also make the cauldron now. See, now the other thing is, I'm not sure if this base version will be hot enough to actually melt the iron. It is not. All right, so back out. Back in again. Place that, empty my inventory more. Back out again. And back in. Let's just do this to solve all future. Okay, I just remembered that actually I need to make the seared. Uh, where did there it is? Okay. But if I make a seared tank, it can run at a higher temperature than the seared heater. and run off lava. So for now, let's just do this and put the leaves in there. Cobblestone. that and I need more sand again yeah that's the right machine okay but actually I should figure out how much sand I need Ooh, actually I should be able to also make a Tin piece. Tin amber, flint, need clay. Wait, I ran out of clay pieces? That's actually kind of surprising. Okay, flint. So I need bone and clay. Alright. Let's grab this. Let's just grab a little bit of everything that's filled my inventory. Well, 
Let's just dump a couple things I don't need. Why am I still carrying around the cake? And donut and stuff. So that's just risking I actually eat the things. Let's store the leaves and the saplings in there. Okay, so... I need... Less than I'm actually getting, I'm pretty sure. Because I needed just... Okay. Technically, now I just need a little bit of bone. There. And then let's harvest everything else, just because... I'm here, so I might as well. Okay. Bone. One tin amber. Everything else goes in for now. Grab the leaves back out. Okay, so the birch sapling. Oh wait, actually, I can also make more bonsai pots. I don't have any way to get the single ingot back out of the smelter at its current stage. Because I don't have any lava. I mean, gold. I could make aluminum brass, I think think aluminum uh brass no nope. uh cast okay nether cake all right but bucket cast But I need gold, which, I mean, that's all right. Tree fluid extract. Oh, that's interesting way of doing it. Gold ore and all that stuff, obviously. Melter. Because, yeah, the base gold doesn't actually produce all that much, but the fluid extractor, average of 53 per log, that's pretty good. So, gold amber requires yellow dye and lead and iron. Couple more bonsai pots. See, but the thing that I can do to get the iron out is use the uh, block mold and get a block of iron out. doing this just so that I have one uh, birch tree sapling for later. I don't think I'll need it, but better to be prepared and not need it than need it and 
it required doing all those steps again. Okay. Tin sapling one. Let's see. So gold and aluminum brass. Aluminum brass I just can't make. But, I mean, the other thing is I wouldn't be able to make it anyhow because seared stuff is locked behind prestige anyhow. So, yeah. Okay, place. Well, I'll take one into this dimension. Place it there. Then back out. So, I need iron. I already have eight here. But I need a oak. Right? No. I need acacia, which is cleaning apple sapling. Which... Uh, apple seeds is a apple, which is a oak sapling, which is cleaning a dirt sapling. Okay, and that's why I left the water there. I don't have any dirt. Okay, there it is. Okay. A uh, crushing tub. Oh, okay. Got the apple, which means that I can do this. Bam. Wait, what? When planted, it becomes an apple sap. But I need a... That was my last dirt sapling. No, because I still have the other one. Can I make a crook? Yes. Hey, it's raining again. Not that many crooks. Much faster saplings. Yeah, already at five. Okay. Just do a little bit of this. Because I just don't want to use a grass block to turn it into farmland. and I don't have any actual uncrafted wood in here. Now I do. Wooden hoe. Oh. Oh, wait, what? Okay, now I can actually break it. So actually, I didn't need to do this, but... Oh, well. No, not that tree. This tree. Put the birch, put the oak. Let's get another oak sapling up in here. Oh yeah, that's how I can best get those. Wait. So I have the apple... no. Do I need the apple sapling? Yes, I did. Okay. What can I use apple juice for? 
don't know. Okay, so. Got another apple sapling, which means I don't need that. And do I get another oak sapling? Yes, okay. Being prepared. Two oak, two apple. Because, yeah, the apple sapling will be needed for other things. The oak, not really. But gold sapling would be nice later. That's not the right dimension. There it is, okay. Back to getting, doing this. The way, is the advancement book any time? Yeah. I've just kind of ignored that slob of my inventory for a while. Dang, no acacia saplings. Come on, I just need one. Hey, there it is. Okay. Let's just get multiples. Okay, so acacia can be used in iron sapling, and that's it, it looks like. Dirt sapling, water, yeah. So, wait, did I just lose a... No, okay, why did I j mm. Note block, redstone. It shall be button. Okay. One there. And one in there. Okay, so... This needs to be a hotter... thing. How can I do this? Cause... Um... Cause these give water, yeah. Put it in the barrel. Then you get a bunch of sugarcane seeds I don't actually need. So what I'm looking after is an infinite supply of water. kind of cramped in this area. Let's see. Other thing is I would want to place a single mm, this is gonna be difficult. Let's just craft a couple workbenches so that I will have the space. So, if I place the lava up here, can run down. 
but then if I place the water, right, that's a button. Yeah. It's there, water. Which is honestly why I needed the barrel more than the other thing. Because these takes up forever. That's not... Could make... Uh, let's see. So... Three... Four... Yeah, I could make do with four or five. but not six. That's gonna be difficult. Uh, maybe if I, wait, what happened to the sand I was going to make? Apparently I left all the sand in here. Let's harvest some tin. to try to set up the automatic hopping uh, bonsai pots by the end of today so that I can just leave up the world for a bit, go in and clear out some sticks and other junk. So it'll be full for Friday. Okay, so that's all just a one-to-one -one conversion. So, I need one more sand resin. No, two more. Put the sand leaves away, put the tin sapling and sand sapling and the dirt. Those... Put away the resins. Okay, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Nice and simple. So plus design. Okay. So actually, yeah, let's destroy the apple juice barrel. Put a couple buckets of water in. Yeah, that should be enough. And then 
fix the water up a bit. Because what this is for... No. Okay. Getting ahead of myself slightly. Retains liquid when been broken. Yes. Aren't you glad I didn't say banana? Alright then. Because this will destroy the bucket. But... It can, it can smell the... Iron. Because at the very least, I should set up the Amac Hopper for the iron sapling before I sign off. And then I'll probably want to do it at this level. Along this wall. So wait, that's five. Uh, okay. One bucket. Okay. Uh, ironwood. Bam. Hey, nice. Second sapling directly. Okay, so I need... This, this should give me... A, a, Two to one ratio. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And then if I grab the casting basin. kind of a race against time as the lava will go down no matter what because it's always heating this thing dang okay let's repair the metalk real quick no not like that on more charcoal creation. Okay. A uh, couple more pieces. So, wait. Two ingots are left? Uh, so, if it's Nine per block, and two ingots are left. I need to get eight more block and eight more ambers. in order to actually empty the smeltery. Of course, I should probably check to be sure that the bonsai pots do work for me. Bonsai pot. Bam. Cow bonsai. See, now the thing is... It has... 
to be at least have two blocks above it for the bonsai to work. Okay, and that does work. Because then while I'm focusing on this one, that one will also be growing. I'll need to figure out how to make a trashing, trashing system or some way to get the oak wood and sticks out. But looks like it's going to work everything else. Okay, this is going to be a little overkill, but I also have enough ingots I can make a bucket. Now, the bit is that I need petrified pieces to get gravel. Oh, I mean not gravel, cobblestone. Because now I can actually set up the cobble generator. So wait, actually, if I do have the water there for now, pick up and move. Okay. Okay, but this is a slight issue with it trying to burn me constantly. But it means that it can't actually get to the lava. Actually, that allows me to make a stone cauldron. Okay, another iron block worth, which means another hopper to be made. Actually, two more hoppers to be made. Nice. Alright, but the other thing is, actually, can, because I know that, oh god, yep, that works, slightly laggy. Oh, and actually, I just need the lower one. So actually that works really well. Cause I can put multiple saplings next to each other then. Okay. Sticks can just go. Bilbo, don't you dare start barking. Bilbo. Okay. 
Whose dog is that even barking? Still have a piece of glass left? No, because I got the exact amount. But then I can cut down on the size of the Actually, let's just replace this with a updated version, since I need sand often enough. Okay, that does work. But this is where the um, This is where the oak, well, the wood is going to be a problem. Because I don't need the wood or the sticks, actually. No. Mm, I'll see if there's a way I can balance that. different uh, area, it continues to work. Okay, so now... Uh, do I do that now? No. Yes. Because... No, I need couple pieces of cobblestone. Wait. Void pickaxe. Ender alloy. Fire charges. Ender infused sticks. Interesting. See, because, yeah, I need cobblestone. Which means placing these back down and getting a little couple pieces of cobblestone. Or, alternatively, I could use petrified acorns and that stuff. But... This way works. Hey, Bilbo! Bilbo! He's over on the other desk, being slightly problematic. Okay. Lava on the left, water on the right, easy. Uh, let's place this right here. This way. Did that work? Top one one. Yeah, Bilbo. Good boy. Okay, just freed up a massive area of my uh, base. Oh, Bilbo. Bilbo! It's on top of a furnace and not on top of a heat source. I 
at least it's instant even above a torch. Hi there, Bilbo. You want to come up? I guess I did tear that out. Okay. So. Okay, it doesn't produce at quite the same speed. But it does produce. Okay. So actually, what do I need for the next bit? I need redstone, which is over here. But that I just need. Okay, yeah, definitely need to switch back to this space. Because I need some grass. And bone meal. Blue orchid. That might be useful. Carrot seeds. Okay, I'm getting a lot of blue. What can I make out of light blue? Uh, nothing. All right. Uh, how can I? get red and yellow then. Because, I mean, if I get a beetroot seed... Uh, yeah, actually, that might work. I already have a hoe. Let's keep the bone meal on me. Okay. So, let's actually... It will do this with the iron saplings. So that there's a pretty steady production of iron. I don't think I need all much of it later, but it will work. Buckets worth of water. Okay, beetroot, melon, a carrot. Okay, so beetroot, red dye. Okay. Red dye and coal is probably coal sapling. Bam. It's electric. Let's also put this in this area. Melons. Are they useful in any way to me? I mean, I can make a stencil table out of melons. But otherwise, no. So let's tear that up. Carrots. Probably same situation. All sorts of foods. And pig seeds. Actually, that could be useful. Need some normal seeds, though. And melon pink slime seeds, actually? Yeah. 
the way pink slime seeds instead of purple slime seeds or parrot seeds okay okay not too bad not too bad it's actually yeah let's leave that for a little bit okay that's enough uh shulker seeds okay See, sadly, you can't have the cobblestone generator going directly into here. Oh, that's the problem with having the slabs. It only stacks up to 32. Hmm. Eh. That's alright. It's still a lot of material that can be made. Hi there, chicken. So, can I put any... put the chicken to any use? I know the egg is useful for something. I think it was the soul generator, though. Yeah. Oh, I can make a fried egg. Yeah, it was the, uh, soul generator. So then, how about chicken? Is this any use? Could make raw chicken wings, chicken jerky. Could make leather out of the cooked chicken. Uh, how about feathers? Feathers important. Can trade seeds for feathers. All right. Mm, I could also use it as a seed disposal. Five ingots. So two iron trees worth give me enough. Well, that decided what was happening to that chicken. Oops. I didn't push it out of the way, and so it Respond instantly. Freaky, but all right. Let's see, grab a clay sapling. Because once I get the other um, 5x5, five five. I'm figuring I can just make the ceiling out of chess, well, chess slabs, and just have all the trees in there. Need some way to, like, indicate them, but it should work. That's true, I need normal blue dye. And yellow dye. But 
for now, I'm just crafting a whole bunch of hoppers. Scrub. Oh my god. So I already decided that the blue orchid was useless to me, right? Yeah. Because I can use it to dye a couple things, but it's not really actually useful dyeing things. Okay. Let's just take the important things out there for now. That's true. This is the fertile soil one. Uh, let's deal with both fertile soil ones right now. Okay. Hopping bond size. gonna be slightly annoying. So if I do this, where did the, there it is, okay. And actually click at the right time. Oh. Yeah. Okay, and then replace that. Dirt is being made. Okay, so wait. Let's get the other 5x5. Five five. So then, once I finish, I can go get something to eat, and just move all the bonsai pots into the other space. So, what do I need for... it? Well, I guess the better question is, what generator should I use? 
like a simple combustion generator is the cheapest, but culinary generator could work long term. Simple turbine generator. Oh, that requires steam. Yeah, I don't want steam. Okay. So, no matter what, I'm going to need a furnace and some cobblestone. I need some iron. is if once this reached the 32 stacks so if it would move it then up to this one but it probably won't do that of course honestly I could just now yeah I could just switch that double stack into a single chest and it would work perfectly fine don't really want to do that for whatever reason. Oh yeah, because it would be a large amount of cobblestone that just goes everywhere. Oh, nice. Another redstone sapling. So I can make the other saplings when I actually get the material for it. Ooh, another egg. Which Lava on redstone amber. Alright. So, I can turn that into redstone amber, which is 900 mil buckets of destabilized. I can turn it, oh wait, that's just these, the acorns that can turn into that. Okay. Uh, I guess just the simple combustion generator would make sense. Need some stone. What did I make this piece of glass for? I'm not sure. 71 recipes! Yeah, I'm not gonna go searching for that. But hey, when I need it, it'll be there. Okay, so I want a clay sapling and a wait no because that's clay sapling isn't it okay so that's clay tin bone coal so what's not there? petrified Clay, tin, bone. Clay, tin, bone. Okay, so gravel is missing. Yes, the gravel is missing. Okay, so that's all of the trees. And when these get full, I just need to empty the... Wait, can I use sticks to repair? No. But when they get full, I just need to empty out the logs. And everything else is actually useful crafting material. Actually, can I... <sighs> 
No, I can't. Okay. But I could. High IQ moments. Okay, that doesn't lose anything. At least I don't think it does. Bam, seven by seven. All right. Which means I kind of want to move all this out one. Oh, chicken. Because, see, I want to go out to here, place it down, so that the main hub entrance, since I can't actually change the size of this one. Okay, yes, much bigger. So, Oak Cauldron sells shit sit over there. Those sell shit there. Uh, let's just place these right there for now. Yeah, let's just shove everything in for now. Actually, I can then turn this one into just the general uh, half slab with saplings in it. This shall be the sapling and leaf chest. And seeds, how about? And then... Plant drops. No, I don't think you can. Oh, a sapling made it through. Okay. Just place all of this in here for now. Fix it later. I'll need another grass block. Okay, take the seeds out and the f veggies. Yeah, then I can just come in here, grab out the useful stuff, leave the more useless stuff. Eventually I'll have a stick and oak wood, just trash pile. This 
since it always gives oak, I can set up just a trash can for that. Wait, what? It's the cobblestone? What? Okay. That's kind of dumb. Feel kind of cheated from that. That's not the right chest for most of that. See, because now I just need to place a crafting table like that. There. And then once I get the other 7x7, seven seven, I can place it right there. Okay, grab the two buckets. Grab that, and grab that. right here. Yeah, it makes lots of cobblestone when just left. Okay. So this... shoot. There goes all the water. And I can make more. Easily enough, at least. Well, there goes the little bit of iron that was left. Right, and then these can just come with. Yeah, there's still trees left in there. Um, is there enough iron? <laughs> okay. Um, I need a small hopper. Which means more of these. Oh yeah, let's also make a... Sugar cane farm. Cause yeah, I need water. Let's just leave those for now. tub. So, if I make... Well, saplings give water. Do carrots also give water? No, carrots do not. Do beetroots give water? No. They do not. Do watermelon give water? No. Okay. So I guess. Uh, yeah. I mean, it's 
cheap enough. And sugarcane seeds are annoying, but it works. So I guess instead we'll stick with this. Can't hop up because the tiny chest is not big enough. Really, it requires putting that in every time. Alright. I mean, I guess that is quality of life, so if you accidentally toss in too much cobblestone, it doesn't then just keep creating lava of all over your cobblestone. But, if you wanted to do that, it's kind of annoying. Okay. So that's all the lava I need. I need another more porcelain because I need the tube thing which I'm going to assume is more than it's five don't have an extra one anywhere so clay Oh, I still don't have clay switched over. Okay. Let's swap this out for now. Okay, actually, I have enough redstone that I should be able to make a clock. So, I need a clock. It's on repeater, chiseled stone, and dreadstone sticks. Well, not chiseled stone, just normal stone. I don't have a furnace here yet. A uh, wall of furnaces shall go above. No. Yes, no. Shall go in above and to the right, left of. Yeah. Now that will be good enough. Let's get some more stone cooked. So then it's there for later time. Alright, I also need a some more chests. And a couple Whoppers. Required. 
one of those. So that's done. But then, bam, okay. And then I don't even actually want it on this side. But... Just leave that off for now. Okay. So, I want to finish making the rest of the planters into hopping ones. So, we need to go here, tear them all up, and then we can remove the crafting table and the wood, and then this is empty for whatever I decide to put in it, but then this, I need to make all of these hopping let's put a single crafting bench here for ease of access okay that one does actually have a tree in it and then I need another of these. Okay, so grab some of this stuff. And I need signs. And I got trapdoors. Redstone. Iron. Dirt. Sand. Petrify. Uh. Yeah, that was right. Gravel. Kill. Clay. Bone. And tin. Tin. Okay, but yeah, I need to do something about the oak production. But, that's for a later episode. Oh. So, I'm going to stop it here for today, guys. Thank you for watching. We made some pretty good progress. Um, Endstone and Chorus Fruit are the next two. I have Enders, Blaze Rod, and Ender Pearl. I could probably make a generator pretty much as soon as I actually like. Well, no, weren't that? Uh, already was. Let's make a generator before I go. 
um, simp. Oh yeah, I need a couple pieces of stone. Bam. Okay, generator done. Okay, let's load this in and then leave it again. I would actually. Let's just put trees. Yeah. I could once I figure out how to pipe energy out, I could set up just to have all the wood go to a pipe system to do that. Yeah, that could work. Okay. But the other thing is now that I have the clay trees in here. Let's just do this. And then once I finish once I actually stop streaming for the day, since I'm getting distracted. Wait, oh wait, I need to fire it. Um, I will end up setting it to land mode and just sitting here. Use the fluid transfer pipe. Okay. Do I need another faucet? No. Wait. Okay. No. What? How do you use channels? Okay. No. This loud flung on the side. No. Oops. But can no. Actually, could that work? See, because yeah, it uses faucet to travel like that. So if I do it like that, no. But pretty close. I think I just need a thing of tanks, pretty much, set up. Okay. So wait, that gave 36, I think, millibuckets. Yeah, that sounds about right, being 36. Which then, if I go here... Because that gives 12, so that gives 16. So if I take three of these, travel back out, place it in here, and that should give five ingots worth. No, wait. What? Because <laughs> four ingots, six nuggets. That's not correct, Matt. Okay, five ingots. So, parent. Oh, mmm. Back in. Okay. So, I'm gonna stop here for today, guys. There. Now I can do that. Thanks for coming to the stream. Catch me Friday. See ya.